Hello everyone, welcome back. So I, um, I'm a big history buff, and if you've ever watched the Dam Busters, it's about uh, World War II trying to blow up a German dam. Not important. What's important is they had to have they had to be a certain height off the deck, and the one way they did that is by two lights under the plane. Uh, everybody's used to their depth gauge and setting your depth and everything else. And I was thinking about it, and, well, two laser beams coming together, it's the same height no matter where you are. So the first thing I grabbed was one of these guys, which is your standard laser pointer. I made up this silly little uh, mount for it. And if I can get this just right, it's kind of a pain in the butt. No, it's not going to want to be. Get it just right. There we go. It is a little wobbly. I'm working on that, but just deal with me here for a second. So right now, we see two points. My laser out of alignment. Now, if I crank these points up till my laser is in alignment, which is right about there, and then take this head and move it so they're right on top of each other. And yes, I know, this is, I'm still working on this. This is an idea I've been trying to figure out. So right now, my beams are on top of each other, right? I'm at the right height. Now, if I take this down, you can see the beams are going away from each other, right? If I crank this back up, When my beams meet, the laser's in focus. And this works on a bunch of stuff. So here, if I crank my bed down again, right? And get one of these guys. Same thing, my points aren't aligned. I don't know what my distance here is, but if I crank this up, when they're aligned, we have the right height. So now what my next step is, I, ha I need to replace this laser, because obviously this isn't going to work for me long term, and my little mount isn't very stable. So, my next thing I did here was I went and bought a couple of these guys. Um, I'm going to wire these in and see what it gives me. I have a mount coming and we're going to try these out for today. I'm going to wire one of these up and we'll see how it works. Okay, so what I did was I took the wire for the stock red light, which is still back here. Uh, I soldered in my new laser head into the stock switch or stock power supply, whatever you want to do. Uh, my machine's going to move here when I... Uh, Power it on. All right, and you can now see what I have. So I have just a little wire holding my dot on, and you can see my cross, which is the new guy, and the dot, which is the old one. 
So I'm going to crank my bed down here. You can see the lines move apart. Pretty easy. When you crank your bed back up, everything tightens up. And that dot's in the middle of that cross. My height is perfect. Okay, now let's switch to this uh, wood cookie I have. This is, I don't know, three quarters of an inch. This stuff's three mil, standard three mil. So now I put my chunk in, crank my bed up so the point is in the middle. Right? And bam, there's my height. Works perfect. Doesn't matter what I put in there. Doesn't matter how it's in there. You got two points of reference and you've got your height. So, yeah, I don't know. I just uh, thought I'd play with it and I'm going to try this out for a little bit and see how well it works. Check it and we'll see. But uh, there's a little tip for you guys. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great day. Bye-bye.